Hi, Mike Munchmore here with PCMag.com and I'm going to show you Office 2016 on a Surface Hub. Actually, Matt Shaw with Microsoft is going to show you. Um, Office 26 is integrated into this corporate um, boardroom type electronic whiteboard. So, Matt, you want to show us how Office sure. works? Sure. So this is the 55-inch Microsoft Surface Hub. It has Office directly integrated into the operating system, so it's always available to any user who walks up and uses it. We have PowerPoint, Word, Excel. We also included the new browser, Edge. Um, and we also have our own whiteboard. So this is whiteboard for a large device. It's built on OneNote, and it has the best inking experience that there is. So if you grab a pen, feel free to grab a pen right here, and I grab a pen, we can both ink at the same time. We call that side-by-side -side collaboration. When it's off the select. <laughs> so you can be inking, I can be inking. And because this is OneNote, we can select documents, we can select this, we can move it, we can scale it. It's an infinite canvas, it goes on forever. And then when you're done with your OneNote file, you simply tap the mail icon, enter in whoever you want to mail this to, you'll get the OneNote file and you'll get a PNG file so you can continue to iterate on your ideas within OneNote yourself. So how about like Excel and Word? How do they, would, would people even use those on a display like this? Of course. So whenever you want to look at data, uh, the personal device is fantastic for looking at a data structure. But when you look at it on a Surface Hub, you're now getting a large platform. So let's just imagine that we had um, our charts and our graphs and, and everything up here. You're now getting it on a very large scale. So you're able to see more data uh, than you would on a smaller screen. And again, because it's built in a large screen, it's optimized for touch, it's optimized for pen. A lot of times, I guess, a meeting, we have people looking at spreadsheets during our meetings too. What stories are we going to run? So I can't I can see that's useful. What about Word, though? So again, um, everything is different when you start thinking about things as a group device and on a larger scale. So uh, Word is also built in. Um, you have the on-screen keyboard. Again, everything is optimized for touch and for pen on a large scale. And this looks exactly like the Word 2016 that will Correct. be on like smaller device like this, like this. <laughs> that would. <laughs> Correct. So um, one of the things that we wanted to do is bring content in. So let's say we have a PowerPoint deck here that we're working on. The Surface Hub allows you to ingest that video into here. So we'll quick tap here. And now we have our content from our personal device showing up on the Surface Hub. Not only is it showing up, but we have ink back and touch back built into this directly. So now I can control the PowerPoint that's running on the Surface Pro on the Surface Hub. So let's start our presentation. So I'm driving this deck that's on the Surface Pro on the Surface Hub. Not only is touch enabled, but of course, ink is built in as well. Oh, wow. That's pretty nice. And that goes directly back to the Surface Pro 3. Ink back and touch back to your personal device. Yeah, PowerPoint is a great use for this display. Exactly. So when are these going to be available? So we're working on that right now. We're expected to release sometime soon. And how much will they cost? The 55-inch version is $6,999, and the 84-inch 4K version is $19,999. Not so bad for a big corporation. Correct, correct. With a lot of conferences. Yep. Thanks so much, Matt. Likewise.